Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's hard to form here and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to back up your world in Minecraft Windows 10 edition. Now it's really simple and all you have to do firstly is open up the file explorer that is there in literally every Windows 10 PC and laptop. So it's basically this icon that you can see on your screen right now and you have to go ahead and open it up. All right guys, so we are in file explorer and basically in this PC all right. So just select whichever folder that you want to that you want to store your Minecraft worlds in all right. So for me, I'm just going to go ahead and choose desktop. And then once I click on desktop, all right, so it should open this. And now what you're going to do is right click, all right. So right click and then go ahead and click on new and click on folders. And then you can name the folder whatever you want. For me, I'm just going to name it Minecraft backups because this is what it is. And yeah, guys, so once we create this, so remember, this is your store uh, location. So wherever you want, it can be either in desktop, it can be in documents, it can even be in downloads, although that is a bit weird. But I would recommend that you either choose documents or desktop, either one of these, and then go ahead and create a folder called Minecraft Backups or just Minecraft World Backups, whatever you want in general. Just You just have to remember the folder name really. And now we can go ahead and head back into Minecraft Windows 10. All right, guys, so we are back in Minecraft and now what you're going to do is go ahead and click on play and then select whichever world that you want to back up. You can have multiple worlds. It doesn't really matter. And then what you need to do. All right, so I'm just going to select this world called second. And what you need to do is click on this edit button over here, which is the pencil icon and then scroll all the way down. All right, so a lot of people do not know this feature. Surprisingly, what you need to do is scroll all the way down till you see export world. Now you'll see a ton of options here. Export world, delete world, reset random tick and copy world. What you want to do is click on export world. So what you need to do is go ahead and click on export world. All right. And now what it's going to do, all right, so it's going to take some time. And now what you need to do is remember where you kept your Minecraft files, all right. So for me, I kept it in desktop where I made the folder, I mean. So remember, we had made a folder that time. And it's over here, Minecraft backups, as you guys can see. So this is the folder. It's going to be empty, obviously, since you just made it. Anyway, what you're going to do is just go ahead and click on it. And then what you're going to do is go ahead and click on export world. Now it should take some time and this is the screen that's going to appear. And now as you guys can see, so level export finished successfully. And now what we can do is go ahead and head back into the folder. And I'm going to be showing you guys that the world is stored in there. All right, guys, so we are back in the desktop folder as you guys can see. And then over here, as you guys can see, so Minecraft backups, I'm just going to go ahead and double click on it. So this is the world uh, second dot MC world. And basically, if you delete Minecraft and reinstall it, your worlds will be deleted or if you join the beta. And so if you want to get the backup, this is how you do it. And now what you can do is go ahead and double click this. All right, just go ahead and double click this. And then it's going to open up Minecraft automatically with no problem whatsoever. And now it's going to see level import started and level import finished successfully. Now, as you guys can see, so this is the exact same world. And I have two copies of it, but anyway, so I'm just going to go ahead and delete this backup of the world. Now that I know that I have this backup, which is completely safe. So in case I delete Minecraft or decide to join the beta, I'll have no problem whatsoever in getting my worlds back. So with that, we have come to a conclusion in this video. So if you guys did enjoy it, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already. And in the meantime, go ahead and check out some of my other videos that are on your screen right now. And I'll catch you guys all time now. See ya.